First Alert Weather with Chief Meteorologist Tom Messner. Well, I suppose the good news is that probably won't happen where Ken is tonight in the dome. So, you know, on the upside, right? Hey, let's talk about why what is happening is happening. We've been watching this area of low pressure that's been coming our way. As expected, it is transferring its energy to the coast here. This is going to become the primary area of low pressure. It will deepen as it gets out over the Atlantic Ocean. Then it will start to move away. But because of that, we've got a ways to go with this storm. Let me give you some details. Any rain snow mix, and we are seeing some of that right in the valley right now, that's going to change to all snow over time here. The snow intensity is going to pick up tonight as that low pressure continues to deepen. We're thinking the highest accumulations happening in the mountains and also over in the Connecticut River Valley. We'll talk more about what we're thinking for accumulations in just a minute. Let's key in on Storm Tracker, show you who is seeing what, where you find the blue a little bit darker here. We've got some snow coming down at a fairly good clip. So figure from northern Rutland County over to Wyndham County and Windsor County and then point south from there. So yeah, from Windsor through Wyndham County. And then you come north of there, not snowing quite as heavily, which is pretty much what we expected, but right up and down the Champlain Valley, you're gonna find some rain mixing in and the radar is picking up on that. Northeast Kingdom, you guys have not seen that much in the way of snow just yet. Took a long time for it to get to you. And I don't think you're gonna find that much in the way of totals, but just be aware, you're definitely not gonna miss this completely. Meanwhile, look at the rain that has made its way into the St. Lawrence Valley. You guys not expecting much snow at all because so much of this will turn out to be rain. All right, temperatures. We're in the 30s. Most spots, not everywhere. Up in Derby, it is 41 degrees. I think with the snow finally arriving, temperature is going to drop for you. And once we lose the daytime heating, the sun goes down, we're all going to find temperatures starting to go down a little bit, especially aloft because, of course, aloft, that's going to help to turn some of that snow over to rain, at least to a certain extent. Well, as that cools down, the snow is going to make it to the ground and temperatures will be going down from where they are. Thinking in the Champlain Valley, we bottom out round about the freezing mark. So the day planner for tomorrow in the Champlain Valley, we get through tonight and that's where we find some fairly decent snow, especially in the mountains. First thing tomorrow morning, seven o'clock, it is going to be snowing, temperature about 33 degrees or so. I think as we come up against noontime, I think we're going to find some rain mixing in in the Champlain Valley again as the storm starts to move out. It's going to be cloudy at five o'clock, maybe a shower or two and temperatures up around 40 degrees or so. Okay, future cast. Let's time this thing out for you. Six o'clock tonight, still finding some rain in the Champlain Valley. Watch the way the snow overspreads. So the rain changes over to snow where you see the blue darker. That's where we're looking at some pretty decent snow coming down. This is midnight tonight, so we could find snow at the rate of an inch an hour happening then and then through part of the few hours after that, and then by the morning time to the north, starting to get a little bit ragged, the storm, but down to the south, it continues to snow at seven o'clock in the morning, and then the stuff starts to work its way out, but note we're starting to find some rain mixing in for some of us, and then by later in the day, a better chance for rain, especially to the north, as we warm up. So the forecast for tonight, rain snow mix for a while in the Champlain Valley, not in the mountains. That mix is going to change to snow. Heaviest snow is going to be a little bit later tonight. For tomorrow, snow in the morning, then it ends as some rain showers in the Champlain Valley. The snow hangs a little bit longer in the southern mountains especially, but then temperatures get fairly warm, 30s to up near 40 degrees. How much snow are we talking about? Well, in the higher elevations, anywhere from 6 to 12 inches, so that's including the uh, Central Mountains on down to the Southern Mountains and then points to the east from there in the Green Mountains. Adirondack 6 to 12 parts uh, of those areas, especially the eastern facing slopes, 3 to 6 in the Champlain Valley and areas in and around there. So the high tomorrow is going to be 39. The storm is kind of winding down. On Sunday, any rain and snow very early goes away. 46 degrees. 47 on Monday, partly sunny. Some showers on Tuesday, 44. Wednesday, partly sunny, 49. Afternoon showers on Thursday, 50 degrees and showers again on Friday with a high of 49.